guys, welcome back to another video. We are reacting to top 15 most surprising videos you will never guess. It was just up uploaded like an hour ago. So we're just gonna watch it. And we still got the weekend now to do some videos. And yeah, let's get into the video. Okay. And don't Number just 15, don't wedding ring taker. You'd never expect to run into a thief at a funeral. When an 88 year old lady passed away, one found her at her funeral home in Texas. A woman was caught on camera taking the wedding ring right off her finger. The suspect was caught on CCTV approaching the open casket oh. of Lois Hicks, who wow. passed away the day prior. When a visitation was held at the Sunset Funeral Home. In Odessa, the suspect is seen struggling to pry the ring off the woman's finger. Once she's managed to collect from the afterlife, she rushes out of the funeral home. Hicks's granddaughter took to Facebook the following day to post her disgust with the person, writing, As if my grandmother's passing away hadn't been hard enough on my entire family. Although the loss of such an heirloom is undoubtedly horrible, it puts a dark spin on the phrase, You can have it when you pry it from my cold hands. Number 14. The Not-So-Great Escape who doesn't like a bumbling crook? Tunsi News published oh God, this video this dude looks in May of weird. A man idiot. in New Orleans is the laughing stock of the city. Wait, After a what the? Impossible esque heist that started off kind of oh, cool. I thought that. I thought that mannequin was a guy. The man likely thought he could pull off the next great escape, but as it turns out, he hadn't done enough pull-ups to prepare himself. It was just after midnight when the man busted through the ceiling of a clothing store. According to the New Orleans Police Department, surveillance video caught him in the act wearing a stock over his head he drops down from the ceiling by rope well this bit all goes according to plan the next certainly doesn't the security alarm sounds off which sets the man off into all out panic mode apparently he hadn't expected it he immediately starts bumbling around attempting to toss up some merchandise to the ceiling before climbing back up the rope to his escape route Unfortunately, he finds he's not strong enough to do so. He then looks to other routes to reach the ceiling, leading him to climb a shelf, but that doesn't work either. Clearly saying to himself, what the heck do I do now? He wanders around the store before pulling up a display of some sort to assist in his climb to the ceiling, which finally pans out, but not for long. The ceiling bursts in beneath him, and he falls to the ground just barely managing to grab a hold of the rope to lessen the blow. While all this bumbling is entertaining, the crook did manage to escape through an exit door and evade police for more than a week. If you're watching this, wanna be crook, next time maybe consider a little less Mission Impossible and a few more pull-ups. Number 13, The Lurker. The last thing you want while you're napping is a figure lurking behind you. But that's what YouTuber Charles Pennywacker caught in this creepy video, which he published to YouTube in April of 2012. Charles wrote, I was goofing around with my camera's night vision in this video. The footage shows a young man fast asleep on a couch. Nothing seems odd until, in the next room beyond, a figure in a black hooded robe is seen gliding past the doorway. It disappears as the young man sleeps on. What in the world is that thing? The way it moves, it definitely wasn't walking. Some in the comments of the video liken the figure to Darth Vader, while others cry fake. Real or fake, the lurker is certainly unnerving. Number 12. Possession. Seeing a woman possessed might just make you more surprised than scared. This video, published by Humor Base in June of 2015, purportedly shows a possessed woman lying face down on the ground. Although she's clearly not in her right mind, a possession is an assertitude. Whatever the case, her actions are out of the ordinary and are causing a standstill on the what road. The a police vehicle with its lights flashing is seen in the background. Although no officers what have yet the hell? At the beginning of the footage. The woman keeps repeating, you see me over and over again. She then rolls to her side, telling the man what? Vaguely, it. She presses up against a car, spreading her legs out in circles once around, screaming and laughing oddly the whole time. 
She keeps taunting onlookers to bring it while making strange this noises. This is why and you do herself. not do drugs, people. You want to be like this lady. You can hear you police sirens in the background as the woman then turns back onto her stomach and starts swimming through the concrete. A police officer is standing in the background, perhaps waiting until paramedics arrive to restrain her. Bystanders explain to the officers what happened, but it's still unclear what set her off. One of the men says that she fell, and they might want to check her. The woman is then seen scooting around the vehicle after one of the officers, while laughing hysterically. Whether possessed by evil spirits or something else, I hope this woman got the help she quite clearly needed. Number 11, Breakthrough. School can be a strange time. This footage shows just one example of this strangeness, leaving nothing behind but question marks. In this video, a $5 dare had been made to a student for climbing up into the ceiling. While it's a surprise, someone would actually $5. take this dare. You've got to be kidding me. Pay off of you a million After dollars. After getting stuck while trying to then lower himself it. onto a toilet, it appears the ceiling has had enough, and in a surprising turn, the entire roof in the shot seems to collapse. With the video ending shortly afterwards, we don't know what was the fallout from this situation, but we can all clearly see it's a bad idea. Number 10. B &E. That's why you don't do dumb Most things. burglars who are looking to take possession stalk a home to ensure there's no one inside before they break Looks in. Looks like an Alabama man. Alabama. Google Nest published this video in June of 20. 16 writing this family were at home sleeping when they heard a noise john's wife galuda walked out and saw two men running out of the house with her purse the couple's surveillance camera video history showed that the men had in fact attempted to ensure no one was home they waited at the door for about five minutes ringing the doorbell more than 20 times before busting in the event happened in broad daylight. One of the intruders can be seen hurrying around, crowbar in hand, looking for valuables to gather. He grabs the purse and rambles from room to room. As another man enters, donning black gloves as he walks through the home, a third man dressed in black then appears, and they all hurry round in the last ditch attempt to make off with valuables. As one of the men breaks something while he stumbles around, it falls to the ground, right before the homeowner brazenly walks out, telling the men to get out of here. The female homeowner doesn't seem phased one bit by the intruders, and the men you don't taunt her, but dodge your around her to leave out the front door. Credit card information, this story your has a happy ideas, ending. your internet. According to the video description, the men were identified using the Nest Cam video clip caught by police and put behind bars. Number 9. Abandoned Church Entering an abandoned church around 2.20 in the morning, you probably expect to be the only visitor, but sometimes you're not You're alone. killing yourself Posted right now. You are going to die. Mitch. You this got video that? affords viewers a chilling surprise. Mitch writes, so I wasn't going to post this just because I don't know if it's ghost related. And I say that because it is possible that someone could have slammed the door. But on second note, it was only me and my girlfriend in the graveyard at that time. So you be the judge. Regardless, the holy building it's appears to be haunted. The pair enter the building, which has clearly been in disuse for a while. There's plaster on the ground and the pews garbage broken and boarded up windows. But it isn't until around 2 minutes 40 seconds into the video that the action occurs. It's then that you hear what we all came here for, the door slamming. This is probably a really nice place at one time. What do you think? I'm sure it was. Are you serious? Mitch hesitantly creeps back to the front of the church to investigate the matter. He admits he's so scared that he can barely walk. He gets his girlfriend to come with him to look. When they arrive at the front of the church, the door is surprisingly not shut, and the night air seems very still. It's unlikely wind or a sudden draft could have slammed it. An abandoned church in a cemetery at night. Actually, although you wouldn't expect it, this sounds like a perfect setting for a haunting. Number what? eight. 
Zombie chicken. This video first went viral last month. You may have seen the zombie chicken come to life on social media. The post of the seven second clip identifies meat on a plate as a chicken. Shot at a restaurant, the so called raw chicken starts writhing around and, with the aid of some wild protuberance, manages to crawl clean off the plate and fall off the edge of the table as the girl screams in fright. The origin of the footage is a mystery, but before it went viral in the US via an English language post <gasps> shared on social media, the footage had already been around oh, I'm doing for YouTube videos in countries, oh. including on oh the my Facebook God. group in Asia. Ah, probably its origin is believed to be China. Your guess is why I just knocked out where it was filmed. Whatever oh yeah, case, now I remember what I was doing. I was doing a YouTube video, reacting to Top 15, and then I see this weird chicken thing, I just knocked out. Oh. USA Today's senior vice editor, Robert Lindman, calls into question the video's beginning and end. Is this real? Away from Look at meat. it. If the footage was authentic, he says, the camera would zoom in close. Is it real? What do you think? Real or dark? Or is it fake? Or not, if it's fake? Is this meat even chicken? Thank God. If it's real, seven, never eat chicken again. Live stream. The trees of this forest are haunted. At least that's what the people of this area believe. Okay. When in search of said ghosts, they actually caught a couple of haunted on video and uploaded it's them it's haunting, to YouTube. you know what it is? A Chinese oh, killing forest. All these people commit suicide. As he explores the wilderness in the dark. Chinese about five suicide forest. A Japanese suicide forest. Why they call trees? Unbeknownst to the man in the helmet below, it appears in the top left corner, zooming in on the so-called ghost. It's difficult to make out any features. In fact, it looks very similar to oh. the surrounding leaves, although it emerged out of nowhere. You sure that's ghost? You sure that's Around not like after its leaf? Appearance, it then disappears from view. Okay, the that's, that's definitely a ghost. I will not video. show what I see a much clearer sh image of what appears to be a spirit in the darkness surrounding the trees. No. The Hell no. Hell no. Who? Into the ether. <laughs> Whatever this creepy voice is, these dudes must be brave. I most certainly were <gasps> wonder it at night. Jesus Christ. Six, road collapse. Canadians in Nova Scotia Oh, a hell. The road completely disappeared with the tide. Heavy rainfall caused flooding in the area. So much so that a section of cold you ride on that, you're dead. And vanished into the waters of a river below. The whole thing was caught on video by Tara Haddad, who shared the recorded incident on Twitter. Haddad called the incident absolutely terrifying. Recounting to CBS News, that was really scary. We haven't seen anything like this before. Luckily, he'd seen the collapse from a ways away as he approached the road. If he'd crossed the road even moments later, this could have ended much worse. Social media users called the footage scary and said the old infrastructure was to blame and should be replaced. In fact, Canada's Department of Transportation and Infrastructure Renewal was on it, sending crews to search out areas that had been affected by the flooding and needed to be repaired. Still, this surprising footage shows just what can happen when nature gets angry. Number five. I had flood here before. At the door. Knock, knock. Went to one death. There? A six and a half foot alligator. Uh, that's what the owner oh, of this little beach home found outside her door. Oh, of course, the gator wasn't telling a knock knock. There wasn't joke. upstairs. It was After just all, from the basement. But as it what it is, out, she couldn't get out. She was still in her house. Bell. She didn't know anything about dying. Was caught on owner These Guatemalans they actually bought the house. Camera. They're Although still pumping on water till today. It has been almost two years. Others in the neighborhood were frightened by the encounter. Who? Who is? Jesus Christ. But not before it scratched up Alfano's home and ruined shelving on her walkway. Even more surprising than the other. Hell no. Does a hell no. No. With all these Hell no. Hell hell no. Oh no. Oh hell no. Oh hell. 
If you're lucky enough, however, you've never seen an infestation of this magnitude. Ew. This footage shows a man combing through the hair of a young boy whose head is infested. At first, while the man is combing, you don't really notice the parasitic insects. Ew. It simply looks like the Ew. man is brushing the kid's hair. But once Ew. he's done a thorough combing of the boy's scalp, he holds the brush up to the lens. Ew. And then you can uh. see the insects moving on the comb's prongs. Uh. And not just a few of Ew. them, thousands of them. If you don't want to feel thousands, like you're all over, thousands of them. Video. And someone please get that. Ew! Ew! Get this dude to a goddamn mental hospital, a hospital, a gospel for Christ's sake, a hospital. What do they call that? Death place. The footage was caught by Rob V. Wagger on route to exiting the interstate near Mayland Art Center. Happened a, a lot. At a distance, he notices the pole teeter. Happened a lot. So he breaks slightly. Did you video? Oh, oh my god. Luckily there was the no one in the car. The car got Wagger struck. The engine the blew pole, up when it got struck. He made his way around the obstacle, Surprised, uh, which the Florida surrounded homes were on kind of on car and fire stable, when a concrete truck reversed into it. This just goes to show that surprises can jump out at you when you least Ew. expect them. You can never be too careful. Oh, that's number how it fought concrete Demonic trucks, possession. the cement trucks, what are they called? skeptical them? that the previous possession was a spiritual one. This video posted on YouTube in oh, January of 2015 God, no. by Jonathan Savo looks absolutely legit. Jonathan writes, On January 22nd, 2015, I came to visit my girlfriend in a hospital in Paris. A woman was lying in her own bed next to her and started roaring and talking with a devil voice. The woman was captured roaring in the hospital bed next to the YouTube <laughs> addressing the pair and attacking this an ugly face and telling them they're all going to pass away. The possessed woman claims to have a friend in the mafia who she says she's going to call. At the end oh, of the trip, the God. woman said she's oh. going to take out her drip to leave. It is real, people, and hell is real. The possessed woman tried to get up and apparently wanted to take the life of the person sitting alongside her. The woman was stopped by five nurses who restrained her, pushing the rest of the patients to leave the room. Unfortunately, Jonathan had no clue what happened after that, although he says he heard the woman's voice still roaring that she wanted to take their lives. Trying to play with you, trying to scare you. Alive, the possessed woman must not have succeeded. Before we get to number one, my name is Chills, and I hope you enjoy my creation. Are you curious? Oh yeah, about don't what watch like his new video. Life? Who am I? Because he has one watching it. So YT don't. To find out. I don't Do know like why, but just don't. If you answered yes, then tap the follow button and follow Dylan as Chills. They got that stuff, Chills. When you got that egg in the lawn, oh god, it's so chilling. Way you'll be notified of the new video we upload every Tuesday. Number one, Bella. too close for comfort. Bella. Come to me, little Bella. Life. In northern Greece, an approaching a storm drew this eager onlooker out onto his balcony, <laughs> where he stood filling the dark, cloudy sky. At first, everything seems for a moment calm, <gasps> until a bolt of lightning takes this opportune moment to show the world what it's made of. Reaching the ground with a deafening bang against a nearby rooftop. <laughs> you can almost feel the electrifying ferocity of nature as the storm rains down its raging light. The person filming is either forcibly oh, I feel bad for the people. They're fright. probably as the dead. Camera falls away from the show before returning to no the way they're not dead. Was this nature? No way. There's no way. Or is angry for some reason? You can only guess. But the video is a lesson learned. The next time you're curious about a lightning storm, remind yourself that curiosity took the life of the cat. 
and it nearly took the life of this man as well. Thanks for checking out oh. this video. Be sure to subscribe well, to this video if you count down every Tuesday and Saturday. <laughs> or if you're still not convinced, here are some of our other videos Bye. that you'd like. Bye. Enjoy. <laughs>